test your might. So this is gonna be the before of the sound. I've got it. That's about 20 feet away. I'd say maybe 18 feet away. I marked the ground so that way the audio is gonna be the same distance when I do the before and after. So I'm gonna start it up and you're gonna hear the stock Indian Scout exhaust. idling. What I'm gonna do is download a decimal reader. I'm actually gonna mark the ground too. Let's do this. I'm gonna go right there. We're at 70, between 72 and 73. It does go a little louder when I talk. But this Again, this is 18 feet away, so I'm gonna check that in the, when I'm done. Shaky. I do have the video, I just don't have audio on it. But what you want to do is uh, you got to when imagine both of them are there. You got to take off this bolt, this bolt, and this bolt from behind. It's a 13 millimeter 
Um, I do have one of these ratcheting wrenches that you can get um, underneath and um, it does have a pivoting angle. So if you need to get at a certain angle, you can do that. Um, one of the tips that I, that I mentioned that I didn't catch audio on is uh, when you're pulling, when you're getting them out and you do have a closed end um, ratchet like this, you want to make sure not to take the screws out too far because if you're hitting, you want to get it out far enough to where you can pull it out and just undo the rest with your fingers. Otherwise you might get it stuck on there. This one was a little tricky because uh, this and this are so close together. I actually had to bend this out and it, it is a little movable. Uh, but you kind of have to use your might to bend that up. These are a little more, a little more plain and simple. Now that's a 15 millimeter right there. And then once you get all of those loose, you're able to jiggle these out. So got one out right there. Kind of looks like a missile. Uh, look at uh, so this is the size difference. Check that out. I'm just gonna kind of pop that on there. <laughs> so I painted it with some some uh, high tech paint, but. Um, it's a little bit lighter. I should have kept it, but oh well, I, I'm, I'm fine with it. So in fact, I'm just going to put one on. I'm going to put one on next to the other one to show uh, the size difference. Stand by for that. Yeah, I did this little this little ring right here. This clamp um, was originally silver. You don't really see it because it goes in there, um, but I, I painted both of them. So just in case you're wondering why it looks different. but. Um, I didn't do anything with the inside, that's the original. It's got a built-in baffle. So, here we go. And I did have a question when I was looking at other videos. I wasn't sure if you could choose your own position but it looks like you can and I almost fucked up right now by not having the ring on there because else how else would I get that on there so yes you obviously want to have this on uh, I'm have it this way that way I can access the bolt in the back I love it when I catch a mistake before it happens There's the angle I chose. You can still you can see that a little bit. It's curved out this way. The exhaust shoots out that way. Uh, I like that. I'm gonna go with that. So I'm taking these out. Don't need these anymore. Plus, I don't want them to fall out. So I like how it looks a little bit further out than the, than the other one. I wonder if I can lock that in. 
If I can, I'm gonna do it. I've got my mark right here. I've got I know I know I've got the front of the tripod right dead center. So it's right there. And I have this mark here where my phone was to do the, the sound meter. So let me go turn that baby on, see what we got. So remember it was at 72 to 75 decibels on the stock exhaust. Now let's see what we got with the uh, the GP shorties, quote unquote GP shorties from low industry. I'm not sure if you can see that, but take my word for it, it's 85 decibels. So I think an airplane is like 110 or 120. Uh, this jumped up about, uh, about 13 decibels. So that's not as good, boy. This is just idling. Definitely, definitely loud enough for people to hear you. Um, so like they say, loud pipes saves lives. So if this might help you at least once, that's all you need, baby. I still might do the Vans and Heinz um, slash cuts. Uh, those are 400 bucks, but um, can't really do 400 bucks right now. I just bought a ticket to Dallas to go to the Get On uh, Moto Fest um, in May, May 21st to the 23rd. So that, that was you know, 600 bucks right there. Plus, I got a new motorcycle payment, obviously. So uh, I got to do this a little bit sooner and a lot more affordable. And I figured if it sucked, you know, I, I, it's just 90 bucks, not a big deal. So. Maybe I can even sell them to somebody else that might want them. But um, yeah, I like it. I'm going to keep them on. Thanks for watching. And um, hey, stay safe out there. And catch you on the next one. Later.